Before I go on uh, tell you guys what the um uh the situation uh what Dirty is talking about, let's talk about WrestleMania thirty seven um uh what I just saw um last Sunday. Cause let's let's say it's legit as it they top it off with the main event between Bianca Belair and Sasha Banks. Cause uh trust me, I love the main event as much as they do. So kudos to Bianca and Sasha. These two are the greatest main events of all time. Uh, so let's talk about night two. So first of all, we got Oscar versus uh, Rhea Ripley for the World Women's Champion. Now I thought this gonna be uh, they're gonna top up uh, um, uh, for night one, but ain't that happened? Uh, Rhea Ripley uh, 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 took advantage uh, so early they beat the brakes on uh, Oscar, and she took the title. Now. That that makes me uh realize that I ain't reacted uh to NXT Takeover uh stand and deliver when we Kyle Gonzalez won the NXT Women's Championship. Now three women, three women holds the belt. Bianca Belair, Will Ripley, and Mich and Raquel Gonzalez. All three holds the belt. These three best friends, man, they bl oh my gosh, yo, I got goosebumps right there when I was saw. Yo, when I first saw the uh these uh them in, in a picture uh back in the days, uh when they debut, they 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 bring up to all to now, the same um, yo, I'm speechless when I saw that reaction, uh cause the moment I saw NST uh when Raquel Gonzalez um uh when she introduced uh Tyler Valkyrie uh I don't know uh what's her real name, but uh she's new to that. That she she's gonna face her, and with Kel Gonzalez, uh, uh, remind her if you ever uh, interrupt me again, it's gonna I'm gonna shut that dog. Where 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 um or what? Yeah. Oh man, I ain't gonna talk about that. I ain't gonna uh uh try, uh talk about that. So, we literally uh it, uh came out there and I go face to face with Kel Gonzalez, but they hug each other. And here comes Bianca Belair comes in afterwards, and, and all three of them hug each other. They made the uh. The best memories they have since they debuted at NST, since day one. Yo, I love that uh, reaction. So, cause with Ripley, Belair, and with Kel Gonzalez completely reshaping the power structure in the women's division. Oh man, yo, they top up real good. They top up real good. Now, mm, man, the gates are all open for all women's divisions, so... Well, if they're ready, uh, they'll, they'll be happy to uh, face any challenges. So, uh, new superstars, oh man, get, get ready for that one. Oh man, I can't wait to see what these three women are capable of. Uh, uh, see what they uh, see what they have. Next, we have Intercontinental Championship um, for, uh, between Apollo Crews and Big E. Now, we, uh, we first saw uh, Wally perform uh, Big E's entrance. Uh, that was legit. It was lit. I love it. Man, I love uh, Biggie's interest, and especially uh, the, the pull up for fireworks too. So, I don't know why um, they, uh, yo, I, I understand that they, uh, they announced the, uh, the Nigerian drum match, but they, uh, they barely didn't touch the drums ever since they put the match. That, that's the first error that they made a mistake. The only thing they use is uh, that candlesticks and, and the gong. Mm. So, Apollo Crews uh uh win win the match when when it feels uh uh what what's his name again um uh Double Cow uh, AKA um who's this guy uh I I would call uh Double Cow um uh, you know what? let's call him DK I will call him DK from now on cause cause this man uh uh, uh he put uh, like some more uh some more spike on, on Biggie. Eliminated right now, and it was the last um, Apollo Crews win the smash. So he's the New York Cardinal Champion. Congratulations. Uh man. That was some good stuff. Man, but next time, use the drums, by the way, because I don't know why, why I didn't do it. Next, we got the United States Championship uh, between Sheamus and, and Matt Will. Now, I I know this match is going uh, to be, um, be quick, but... Sheamus uh, uh, made a big win against um, uh, Matt Will. So, he took it to another level. Yeah, bro. 
that moonsault that uh that uh, Matt Will did or uh, with the rope, the Sheamus hit that ball kick just the right time to and, and made him face bleed. I was like, yo, that was yo, that was a. I don't I don't remember uh, uh when Shelton Benjamin do uh the springboard jump kick when Shawn Michaels super kick him, man. But this one, mm, at, that could be equal. So. Congratulations to Sheamus becoming the United States Champion. Was a job well done. We got Kevin Lawrence versus Sami Zayn, and, and we got uh YouTube uh YouTuber guy Logan Paul. Uh, even though he's a celebrity, um, uh, yo, I gotta say that um uh Kevin Lawrence uh uh Kevin Lawrence right about Sami Zayn because uh, he 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 has been uh. Uh, way around doing calorie way, so uh, no, it's not my business. So anyway, Kevin Owens, um, then we did uh, beat up um, Sami Zayn because uh, because these two know each other uh, ever since AST. So he hit uh, him and stutter, and then after that, Logan Paul is next. He get a uh, stutter for him. So Kevin Owens wins match. Uh, man, I gotta bring it to him because um. Uh, if Sammy Zayn decides he want uh we match against Kevin Owens, so be it. Yep, so be it. That's where we are doing for this defeat, uh Bray Wyatt. Come on man, you gotta be serious. Well, I thought this match was gonna be good, but when do I end up with uh RKL with the interference uh, uh and let's bliss with distract them? That was a bullshit. Yo this match is is it's it, it, it only just opened it off with me. Uh, that should be the uh, first match, by the way. But 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 still, why the hell am I why I'm seeing this? I thought the Fiend's going to uh, finish Randy right Orton once and for all. But this this, this should end it uh, easily because uh, this, uh, this should be a long match. They should have done that. It should be a long match, uh, about 15 to 30 minutes. It should be uh, ended uh, by uh, the Fiend Bray Wyatt. Uh, only, only, uh, should have done about three RKOs, five RKOs, I don't know. It should be longer. It, it should have been, uh, Alexa Bliss, uh, turning against, uh, the Fiend by using, um, Maverick Claw or whatnot. It, it, it should be any of that. So, this match, it, this, mm, uh, I'm disappointed in this match, but, um, um, so, because, but the way I see uh the uh Alexa Bliss uh appears uh uh, uh appears normal uh when, when the feed pops out of the jack in the box. The same thing that Alexa Bliss uh popular jack in the box when when the uh the ooze come out of her head, distracting the feed and when they want to put in the RKO that, that that was so messed up. So I, I thought this match is good, but it's terrible. Uh it's terrible by the end. Oh man, don't they need to do something about this cause yeah, it's night one is better than night two. Well, we bring up about uh, night chance and Shane Bates to defend against Natalia and Tamina. This is another match that um I almost disappointed, especially that Natalia did not see the uh, tag from Shane Bates uh, when she had to deal with uh, uh night just due to Shawshank. She should have paid attention uh, uh, elsewhere because if she, if she would have uh, done that before, she would have won the uh, Tag Team Championship match. But uh, I'm not going to blame her, uh, by the way, but it's not her fault. It's not her fault. But I'm just saying, because I'm just saying, if she would have paid attention uh, to the tag, then she would have won away and, and do a short shoot away right there, and, and that would be a different story. But nope, she had basic kids out there. I beat the brakes out of the tire. Uh, uh, well, and she let go of the shot shooter, hit with the cool food clutch, she made a tap out, and tied tied the fence. And that, that, mm, that one is, I want to I say, uh, I, 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 I'm okay with that, but um, my dude, oh man, come on, you got to do something about this. Uh, there's no reason for me, uh, to me to watch it if I was saw it. So, we're going down with the main event. Edge. Versus Dave Bryan versus um S Bryan and Roman. Triple triple that match for you was the championship. Uh that match is uh a good good also, but 
the, the, the fish right there, I don't, I don't know why, but, but uh, at least I'm gonna tell you why uh, uh, right now because Roman Reigns, um, uh, as much as I uh, want to uh, see what's going on, because uh, Roman Reigns is going to defend his Universal Championship as long as Jay Uso gets involved with this match, and plus he's going to defend the championship and break the record of Brock Lesnar's longest reign defending Universal Championship for over 500 days, and he's going to save faith. And he's gonna see that uh, record for the rock uh, at WrestleMania uh, uh, 39. He's gonna save it for the rock for WrestleMania 39 because he's not gonna lose the title anytime soon, uh, whatsoever. So, so my disappointment is uh, they should give it to Edge because Edge uh, he has the opportunity to uh, to win the um the Universal Championship when he won the Royal Rumble. So. Because I don't know why they brought uh, Daniel Bryan. Because he only lost a couple of times. But then he inserted himself in a match. And he still lost the match. That being said. Roman Reigns is only appearing. Roman, no. Roman only appearing Edge and Daniel Bryan at the same time. And, and neither of these two are, are not getting, getting involved in this match. So. Well. Uh, so. Roman Reigns. Uh. Uh. I gotta say, uh, congratulations to Roman Reigns. He he is the real tribal chief. But my God, listen, Daniel Bryan should not should not be uh uh facing Roman Reigns uh for his championship as long as. No, I actually wait wait hold on. oh shit, uh, as much as uh phone calls, but. Daniel Bryan should not be facing Roman Reigns as long as uh, Roman is a Universal Championship. Uh, that's my call. The only thing that he's going to defend championship is uh, against either Brock Lesnar or The Rock. Because he's going to save the uh, championship for The Rock. Because The Rock is uh, here for... Uh, 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 actually, he's my employer, by the way. But they're going, to, uh, they're going to put this match card on WrestleMania 39. So, that's, that's my pick. So... Anyways, let's talk about the uh, tail releases right there. So, uh, this this is uh, shocking to me because I don't know why they they did this uh, on purpose. So, they got rid of uh, their clients. They got rid of Samoa Joe, and they also got rid of Kalisto and, and Tucker. Cause, uh, well, you know what's included? Mickey James, Chelsea Green, Wesley Blake, and Bo Dallas and Mojo Ali. So. Uh, I'm not gonna hold y'all, but um, uh, well, I want to uh, say uh, thanks to Mickey James because she performed um, um, plenty of matches and and I don't even have no no use for her. So I want to say uh, thank you to Mickey James. I don't know about Chelsea Green, um, Wesley Blake, Bo Dallas, Mojo White, or Tuck. Uh, actually, I want to talk about Tucker in a sec. So I don't know about uh, any of these guys, but Mojo White, Bo Dallas. Wesley Blake and Chelsea Green. Now, okay, so let's talk about our uh, uh, Sunny Superstars right there. Um, they, they only split out the uh, Lucha Arts party because of uh, the Kalisto, because if there were to be tag team championships, uh, 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 Kalisto would have the uh, title opportunity. He, he could be a 205 Live, the Cruiserweight Champion. He could be a tag team champion, by the way, especially a Tucker. Uh, when, when those they try to uh, split up the uh, heavy machinery, they should be a tag team champions for, for the start. Like, uh, I mean, basically, all you did is uh, put uh, too much storylines on, on always, uh, well, put always on uh, always the many roles right there, and, and made, made them break up uh, doing main base situation. That 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 that's not what I, I try to uh, see. You broke the heavy machinery on purpose. And what did you uh, uh, do? You try to release this guy, uh, Tucker, and leave always uh, by himself? Yo, you couldn't just at least, uh, we, uh, we, uh, we, we formed the tag teams, every machinery, let them have the SmackDown Tag Team Championships. But this 30 job is trying to separate them. That is totally unnecessary. You know, I know exactly uh, what was happening out there, because basically, because basically, uh, what do they? Cause they, they don't want uh, 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 um, uh, uh, some, some. Yo, I can't even set the word with right there, cause 
We got mid cars, main events. Cause don't really know what jobbers like that. And, and they call these superstars jobbers. My God, yo Vince, you gonna pay for that? So, so if Tucker if Tucker is going, we gonna leave Otis. It's all you got. You got. You gonna get rid of Otis next? You wanna get rid of him next because, cause he'll have a uh, taxi partner. Uh, except for um, uh, what's his name? Uh, Shorty G. Uh. What well, he uh, coaching him right there? At uh, yo, I my oh God, I'm so disappointed. So, uh, not talk about Tucker because he's already going now. Because uh, because basically what they need to try to do is try try and not focus on these superstars right here. Try to focus on our uh, tough superstars like Roman Reigns and Drew McIntyre and all these superstars who are, who are main event. So. Yo, I'm not going to focus in on, on the main events right there. We're going to talk about the person, uh, the people who is being released. So, Tucker is uh, one of them. So, uh, let's see. We're going to talk about... Alright, so Kalisto is one of them too. He could have been one of the, uh, the Cruiserweight Championship uh, for 205 Live. He could have been the uh, uh, NXT North American Champion if it's necessary. But, but obviously, he's not he's not NXT anymore. But he's in 205 Live SmackDown. He should be a tag team champion for the Lucha House Party, and I feel disappointed that uh, uh, Dodi uh, does, does not like the tag team uh, at all. I mean, look what they did. You know, I cannot believe what uh, what Dodi uh, try uh, uh, focus on right there. So, wait, Dodi tag team split. So, alright. Alright, so, so we start off with their, uh, the new day. So, um, they split up the new day because, uh, uh, so let's be real, uh, Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods are uh, their tag team champions, uh, probably the former tag team champions, um, uh, probably, uh, be sure. But Biggie, um, uh, yeah, he could be a main event right there. That's why, that's number one. Number two, um, if I'm not mistaken, uh, the Dory uh, split up the, um, no, I don't want to get, uh, get to that, no. Nope. Oh, shit. What am I seeing? Uh, actually, uh, let, let me, uh, focus on that. The only split up the, uh, Sandy, uh, for ST, um, and the bro, Nikki Cross, and, Speaking of Nikki Cross, where is she? Where's the uh, where's the uh, um um Asami members? Cause they should have been tag team champions. Cause they've been uh NXT tag team champions uh for a long time. And they split up uh a couple of uh tag teams like. Oh my God, yo! I keep forgetting the tag. No, wait, let's not focus on the tag teams anyways. But uh uh. I, I, my memory is all chopped up and stuff like that. So, Tucker and Kalisto is out. Let's let's focus on on, on the main uh, reason. Peyton Royce. Uh, people love Peyton Royce. Uh, and she will become uh, uh, the, uh, the the new face of the company. But you know what? Let's not focus on that. So, uh, so so they um uh, basically release uh Peyton Royce because she is one of them. And I don't understand why this uh, uh did this to her because she, she wants the opportunity for the World Women's Championship uh to challenge Oscar. And what happens after that? She lost to Oscar right there, and and I I don't understand why 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 this uh this is happening to her because when I saw the uh wall talk when Payne was uh at make it uh make it seriously when when she become the uh what what. When when she became a World Women's Championship, they go they go uh, look into her. So so my disappointment is why 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 Vince why why the board of directors why I mean you want to tell me that uh that get rid of pay voice that uh that they gonna uh keep keep your uh show alive uh, that, that. and they did exactly the same thing to Billy Case for SmackDown. And, and, and it was just funny. And this is, and this is the reason why the, uh, that 
that makes me uh, sit to my stomach when they split up the archives with when these two of the former uh, women's tag team championships as they won at WrestleMania 35. And these two have worked so hard. They worked so hard to uh, to win the uh, the biggest show uh, uh, in sports entertainment. I mean, you split them up and, and, and you force them to uh, put separate shows and you had nothing to do with it. You did something with Peyton Royce, but you didn't do anything with Billy Kay. I mean, I mean, what's going on? And, 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 and this is... You know what's funny? They made they made a uh, sickness joke by uh, by putting Payne Ways to team up with Lacey Evans. That 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 is uncalled for uh, to me. To me, I I know this is your thing, Vince, but to me, I don't understand. But I don't understand because because I'm so I I'm watching uh uh Dirty. I was like, uh, what, what is this? Or oh, what what is he playing? <clears throat> I mean, this is not the tag team I, I was looking for. The only reason I want to see is Payne Woods and Billy Kay uh, to get back to back to band together. And my dream is to uh, have Payne Woods to be World Women's Champion and Billy Kay uh, to win SmackDown Women's Championship. But what what happened after that? Uh, time was taken short. So and. My first wish is uh gets a uh, uh look here because uh um I do it um man what man I I I don't understand because basically um uh, I I look at Billy K uh on SmackDown and and, and they do uh, uh do her dirty they do her dirty uh real seriously like right? like uh all the superstars are uh, do not want her to record uh well. She do uh some sort of resume and picture in front right there, and I was like, oh, "What what is happening? What, what what is going on? What, what what is happening?" And I I look at I look at it and said, "Yo, is he serious right now? I did I did do a Billy K dirty, my goodness, yo." And I watched resume uh thirty seven uh night one uh for a uh, tag team uh turmoil when Billy K team up with um uh, Carmella they won the first round but the second round uh they fell uh, they failed to do it so so I really disappoint uh to WWE uh that 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 they let them go and. I, I'm trying to uh, uh get this out of my mind. If if I were if I was if I was running uh this company, I, I would have let uh Payton Woods and Billy K have the uh, title opportunities and have them main event the shows. But 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 I, at least Payton Woods is a uh, mid card right there, and and they have Billy K uh uh be a uh, jobber level. So oh my gosh, yo. Yo, know, I I I try I try to be uh realistic right there, but as much as uh the entertain they they try to do uh do a show so right, right there, but me my uh they 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 like, <sighs> oh my gosh, Peyton Royce and Billy K, oh man, uh they they left and I gotta say uh these two uh women uh that. They fought uh, their way. They fought hard uh, to win uh, uh, matches. They, they win uh, tag team championships for the first time at WrestleMania. Uh, they're undefeated at WrestleMania tag teams, but um, uh, as for Peyton Woods, uh, she's still undefeated at WrestleMania. Uh, there's no doubt about it. One and zero. Billy K. Uh, uh, one to one. Wait, the Akai's uh been in the match uh WrestleMania uh, last year. Uh, I don't know, but I uh. I didn't pay attention to uh, a couple of matches, so <clears throat> so uh, Billy K. Payne Royce, if you guys watch this, uh, let me uh, uh, say this: thank you both because I've been a hard, a hardcore fan of you two since uh, since you came in at NXT. Payne Royce, uh, when your music uh, came in at NXT, uh, you're beautiful as you uh, you're beautiful at NXT. And, and, and Billy K, uh, as much as uh, you are, I do have a crush on you. Uh, no doubt about it. 
Uh, I have to be real. So, um, thank you both, uh, for, uh, thank you both for, um, uh, for, uh, memories, uh, the mess that, that you gave us. Uh, thank you for the, the iconic, uh, duo moments, WrestleMania moments, the, uh, Super Show moments. Uh, thank you both. Uh, you are a forever iconic. Oh, man. Or should I say... I can't. Oh man, man. I hope they go to AEW because uh, they could take it. So, uh, Payne, Billy, uh, change your name to uh, 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 uh change your name to your uh, real name. So, uh, go to AEW. But you know what? No, no, what? Don't go to AEW. Okay, come, come to our uh, Warriors of Wrestling. And I'll be here. So, um. Uh, you two uh, are amazing. Uh, I need you both to uh, be on our way to lesson. Please, please, please. <sighs> okay, and now we got to uh, get the main event. Samoa Joe. So, let's talk about Samoa Joe real quick. Ah, <sighs> uh, man. He's, he's the workhorse and he's the uh, heavy hitter, the, the Samoa submission machine. Ah, uh, man. Why would they need... <sighs> Yo, Okay. As much as I respect WWE, I respect Samoa Joe, but what they did to Samoa Joe is the biggest mistake of their lifetime. I mean, uh, uh, of course, he did a really good job at the uh, commentary uh, at first, but but what WWE doesn't uh, did was well, give Samoa Joe uh, a, a return and give him an opportunity for the WWE Championship or Universal Championship. He's a man there. I mean, they gave uh, uh, Bobby Roode a uh, I'm not gonna call Bobby Roode anymore because I'm gonna give him Bobby Roode. Uh, he gave uh, Bobby Roode uh, the championship uh, material. They gave AJ Styles the championship. Uh, well, um, I can't remember uh, who else is out there, but they they gave it uh, some more joy in United States champion. That's one thing. But the uh, the, the only thing that he did give us uh, the uh, the main event that he champion. He's been a former uh, NST championship. Back at NXT, in the last match um, uh, at Dota E, uh, when he faces Brock Lesnar, he did uh, win a title. He never been in Dota E Championship at all. Not even once. And what Dota E did, um, uh, he made some more Joe uh, commentary. And, and after that, uh, WrestleMania 37, he released this guy, which is pissing, uh, pissing me off. Now, I don't know what... Uh, what uh, uh, what um business that uh that you guys been going on to in board director's office? Um, I'm not sure if I uh, if I had to um, uh, be included in this one. But me behind, you need to start playing and and, and uh, break these superstars back. You know what? Let let the other superstars uh stay and bring back Payne Royce, Billy K, um uh, Samoa Joe and Tucker. A fits the bet to normal, and, and I don't know. Uh, I don't know about y'all, but this is going uh, long enough. I've been uh, watching him uh, perform, and I've been watching him perform uh, with Triple H. Um, when Triple H uh, uh, recognized him as champion, uh, uh, such as Samoa Joe, Finn Balor, and, and them. These guys are the workhorse. And, and, and ever since they, they came to WWE, this uh, uh they recognize them. That all they do is uh, let uh, let them sit there and, and do uh, do the uh, uh, mid card and jobber level stuff and do uh, something like that. Uh, that they do, yo, me on, yo, I wish he'd be out of business for uh, anytime soon because we need Shane McMahon or Triple H to run this uh, company because. I don't know why this is going to go uh, way out of line, but, but like, like seriously, because uh, this is, I was just about to uh, talk about this uh, uh, on Twitter, uh, say, uh, why do they, why? And, and it's funny because I haven't been on Twitter uh, since then because nobody reads Twitter, uh, to be honest. Uh, nobody want to read Twitter. And my reaction uh, is like this. Like Peyton Royce, Billy K, and Small Joe, they're doing it's going uh, uh, a lot worse. They they got going well right online. Uh, yo, 
Oh my gosh, yo. I hope, uh, hope not, uh, nothing, anything happens, uh, uh, whatsoever, because. Try to keep my proposal right there. And I, I'm trying to, uh, uh, be reasonable uh, about this, uh, to see what's going on, uh, about the dirty releases. Because, because it, 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 it's shocking to me, because, uh, this is going. So, okay, so I know I'm reading this right there, because Samoa Joe is the, it's the biggest name of the ball. Because, because uh, what happened was that he was removed from the World Commentary team, and they should uh, put him uh, for a dirty championship title picture uh, when he's going to face uh, Bobby Lashley or Drew McIntyre or even Brock Lesnar, I don't know. But they should have put him there in this match. But, but. They let him go. All right. So Chelsea Green. Now I know I gotta read this correctly, but Chelsea Green barely had eight time again to throw day due to an injury. I don't know what's going on with her, cause uh, she may have complained with the uh, the injuries right there. So, so uh, I don't know about her, but uh, it's on her. So Mickey James appeared in the uh, program in, uh, programming during WrestleMania week for NXT commentary. Well. I got no problem with Mickey James, but uh, she she did what she, uh, she did what she had to do uh, to do her business. Uh, she been a uh, couple of matches. Uh, she performed well, so I gotta, gotta give this to her. So yeah. So Tucker has been a complete afterthought ever since Dodi uh, purposely broke up Heavy Machinery from Otis and, and tried to put Otis uh, uh, with Mandy Rose storyline, and and this happens, and. This this is going uh way out out of control, cause, cause, I thought this is um, I don't know uh what is going on uh what uh beat my heart, but, cause he uh start start trying to focus on that. He try to get rid of every uh uh some of the uh uh some old tattoos and try to reform the new ones that 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 possibly uh. Oh my gosh, yo. I don't know. I, 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 mm. Alright, so, Kalisto is one of them, because he has gone, he, he has been going nowhere since, uh, the, the Lucha Arts Party, uh, situation. So, I don't, uh, we don't know about that, but, but he hasn't been pushed, uh, part of the Lucha Arts Party, uh, especially a tag team championship picture that they ain't given an opportunity, because Kalisto and Taco both, uh, they both compared the RJ, uh, the Giant Memorial by Royal, uh, just a couple, uh, nights ago for SmackDown. And, and now they're going to put Kalisto in an after dark, uh, situation, so that's one of them. Wesley Blake, he was last seen on the WWE, uh, more than three months as testament for, uh, King Corbin. Uh, I don't know about him, but, uh, I'm not paying attention to them, so... Well, the Iconics are uh, paying words to Billy K. Uh, these two are, are, are the greatest uh, women's tag team in history because, and, and, and as, as sad as uh, I, I'm, I'm watching this right now, because uh, paying words to Billy K should, should not be released. This, this should be staying in WWE, give, give them more time, reform back the, uh, the tag team division. And, and get the uh, tag team championship belts. These two are, are, are better. These two are more better uh, since Billy up because I can tell by Billy K because uh, when, when Payne was a bit separated from her, Billy K uh, felt weak and made made Payne was stronger because the only thing that made the strongest is the Iconics. So, and this is what Billy K uh, responded uh, with there, and she says this. Oh man, I don't know if I read all that with there because um. Oh, right. She changed her name. She changed her name to uh, Jessica K. Uh, wow, that's a lovely name. So, uh, thank you, Dory Dory, uh, Nine Krupas. Uh, 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 thank you, Triple H, for the uh, past six years. Uh, they have fulfilled my dreams and time for being a ten year old that fell in love with Dory. Uh, the moment I saw the walk on TV, and now I have walked away for a main club moments for Super Showdown and for the Friends family. To win the Tennessee Championship of WrestleMania. I gotta congratulate uh, the Arcanians too, cause 
these two make history. Uh, yo, I gotta uh, give credit uh, for them because they're undefeated in the biggest stage in history for Super Showdown to WrestleMania. Uh, this is why I love the icons. Uh, I love just uh, <laughs> Jessica K. Oh man, can I, maybe I'm gonna call it Jessica uh, 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 Billy K. Uh, in plain words, uh, maybe. Yo, um, uh, 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 Jessica, um, if you want to, uh, come to Twitch, uh, you can, um, I sure that, I sure that, um, yeah, uh, I sure it's open for, uh, right there, so, if you want to, uh, go to Twitch, you can, uh, so, alright, uh, thank you to every single person in both locker rooms and anyone that I pressed your work right behind the scenes, too. I love you all, and never forget you support all the crazy stories we have together. I will miss you all so much, man. I, man, I, I, I see, I see we should go ahead. Um, man, uh, thank you all, fans, for inviting me into your lives. Oh uh, no, thank you, uh, Jessica, uh, uh, Billy Kay. Uh, thank you very, very much. Cause if it wasn't for uh for uh you appearing, um, I wouldn't be here. Uh, support, support you. I give you so much love with the. Uh, I'm gonna say thank you. Oh wait, this is what I put right there. Uh, thank you, Billy K. Uh, thank you so much for performing for us. And you and Payne was an amazing, incredible match at WrestleMania 35. Once again, thank you. Man, I have my uh broken heart to my eye, and I, I clap uh for us. so. Alright, I never forget all the kind of words and memories we had together for over the years. Thank you for my family for always supporting this crazy journey and sacrificing so much for me to achieve it. I honestly would have gotten to where I am without you all. She had my tired heart. She should? Okay, um, uh, can I pause this real quick? Uh, she should be in Smack the World Championship and, and Payway should be in with Championship. That would be the iconic moment. That would be a iconic moment. So, and thank you to my partner Cassie, aka Payway Royce. Oh man, our joy you start together is the only thing that uh, is together. I love you, I'm beyond proud of you, and I am with you forever. Lastly, thank you to anyone that reached out to me today. Knowing that I affected people's lives in a positive way means the absolute world to me. <laughs> Bill oh my gosh. Yo, oh man, we love you, Billy K. Especially Pay Voice too. Because I love the archives. Because you know, the archives are, 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 are so iconic. Because they're all the uh, former tag team championships, and they're, and they're uh, performing in a perfect way. Oh man, but I can't believe Dodi took it away from them. Um, oh man. Uh, we want to thank Dodi, Triple H, and, and the fans uh, for supporting their clients. I'm not going to thank Vince McMahon for what they did to him at, at this split up. Because, um, uh, I, I know. I know you want to uh, try to be uh, nice to Vince McMahon, but to me, we got beef. <laughs> we got beef. <laughs> we got beef in this one, cause, uh, cause what happened uh, is started, cause um, I remember um, uh, I don't know what I don't know what would happen, cause they're, they're gonna sell um, sell to kill. They're gonna sell uh, uh, some restrictions right there for not allowing uh, us to. Uh, to enter uh the camera, the uh the back backpack right there. I had to leave the backpack in the bushes with right there, that's one of them. And I, I never forget that moment because the uh, the moment I went to NST Takeover twenty five yeah uh what's uh NST Takeover twenty five I had to leave the uh the the, the the backpack. This backpack this backpack right here in the bushes and there's no way for me to put it. I'm not gonna put it in the trash. I'm not gonna put it unexposed where somebody's gonna take it. I gotta hide it in the bushes where the security's gonna watch and see. Now, now I gotta uh, figure out what, what, what's going on right there because they need to try to put multiple restrictions on every stadium right there without allowing to uh, put all the stuff that, uh, that we carry. The only thing we gotta do is put a uh, 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 plastic bag right there. And, and you know what's funny? Uh, cause uh, here's here's the funny part because the government they they restrict the uh, plastic bags so 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 no bags will be involved. And this is gonna be the uh the total lockdown for uh for everyone who who carry uh backpacks, posters, all that stuff. Oh my gosh. 
Oh man, and I heard rumors that uh, there will be no dirty live events right there whatsoever. So <sighs> that's one of uh, the bad moments that I ever see. So and I, I feel I feel like uh, uh, this is gonna be uh, uh, a ton of events. So we don't know what's going to happen in the future. So should they return to dirty? Should they bring back the Akaris, Samoa Joe, and Tucker um, to reform the tag teams? Uh, to let Samoa Joe uh, with the uh, championship um, in the future. So I don't know. We're going to find out. Uh, but to me, this release is... Uh, I'm okay with the uh, others who are being released. But the ones that I, I admire are uh, the, uh, the Akaris, Tucker from the um, Heavy Machinery, and Samoa Joe. Uh, oh, man. Big mistake. I'm very disappointed because I don't like the sound uh what they uh what they try to do. And that's my way for the evening. And I promise you this. I promise you this, so I'm going I'm gonna be back uh for, for my vlog videos. I'm probably gonna be uh doing my reactions for uh for SmackDown or ST or AEW or whatever um pay per views I want we had uh that's my plan. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this. I apologize for the rant. Uh, me behind, you need to start playing and, and give us what we want. Stop ignoring the WWE Universe right there. Um, and give us what we want. I'm glad, I'm glad, uh, uh, you did the, uh, your part of WrestleMania, uh, 37, uh, for night one. So that, that's the one. Number two, I don't like the, uh, the way, uh, that, um, that you're not going to listen to the WWE Universe and try with, uh, too much restrictions right there that made the WWE Universe look bad. I'm one of them, so... Uh, if, if I'm not part of the Dirty Universe, then what am I going to be? An AEW? Come on, man. Stop playing. So, so that's my part. So, I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, uh, give it a thumbs up. Um, I don't know uh, what the heck is going on. So, so we're going to find out um, for my not why SmackDown, NST, or AEW. Um, I'm pretty sure this is going to be... Um, uh, one hell of a world culture wise. So WrestleMania is over. We are uh move forward to WrestleMania backlash. So it's gonna be fun. So thank you guys all for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. Oh, by the way, uh uh so uh peace love with DMS uh who passed away for um before WrestleMania so um so fortunate so uh all respect to your DMS family so forever the DMS so anyways uh, good night, everybody, and thank you all for watching. I will see you guys in this one.